This video is sponsored by Two Trees. A while back, Two Trees sent me this massive machine, the TTC450 Pro CNC router. I had zero experience with something like this, but I still managed to play around with it and even cut some acrylic pieces, lighting them up with LEDs. Still, I'll admit the learning curve was pretty intimidating, so I hadn't really pushed my creativity with what this machine can do until now. While working on my latest Zip Guy action figure, I had this idea. What if I make spider bots too? Yeah, they're actually a thing in the comics. My first thought was to 3D print them, but then I figured, why not use the TTC450 Pro to make them instead? So I reached out to Two Trees and asked if they could send over the laser module for the 450 Pro. That's right. This CNC router can actually be converted into a laser cutter, which honestly blows my mind. Living in a small house, I barely have space for one huge machine. So being able to transform it into something completely different is just awesome. And now, here it is, ready to make some critters. But here's the challenge. The spider bots need to be simple enough that my small kids can assemble and customize them on their own. Because really, what's the point of making toys if they can't build them, right? So sit back, relax, and enjoy this build montage.
you have it. This was actually super fun to design and build. What do you think? Should I make more content like this? Toys that aren't necessarily 3D printed, but still use the zip tie articulation system? Let me know down in the comments. But the real test, can my kids actually build them? Let's find out. I'm honestly amazed how well that worked out. I didn't give them any instructions, just a finished piece to look at, and they still figured it out. Huge thanks to my kids and wife for helping build and paint these spider bots. And of course, to Two Trees for sending the TTC450 Pro CNC router slash laser cutter. Links are down in the description below. And if you bought any of their gear through my links, message me so I can send you the SVG files for free. And if you want to see how I assembled the Spider-Man action figure using zip ties, click on this video right here 